infrastruktur digital yang telah dinaik taraf serta permintaan tinggi terhadap perkhidmatan atas talian menjadi antara faktor utama peningkatan bilangan usahawan e-dagang atau e-commerce di Sarawak. Salah satu syarikat tersebut adalah digrocery.com yang berpusat di City of Unity, Kuching, Sarawak. Hello Mr. Naim, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? That's great, I'm good too. Mr. Naim, uh, can I know where you're from? I'm from Bangladesh. What? Really? Yeah. Okay. I came here in Sarawak, in Kuching in 2012. I came as a student. I graduated from Swinburne with my bachelor's. Mm -hmm. And then I completed my master's from Unimas. And then I planned of doing business here. I started Degrosser here to serve the people in Kuching, to contribute back to the Sarawak and to contribute to uh, Kuching, to give back to Kuching. In May 2019, uh, I've seen that a lot of food delivery companies were doing food deliveries. and. No one was doing grocery delivery. So I've seen the demand of grocery delivery in uh, Kuching, in Sarawak, uh, basically in Borneo. We have local products here. Uh, we have cake lapis here. We have uh, companies like FNN. We have, uh, we have this international and local brands in our uh, tea grocery. We have more than 3,000 products here. We also sell the fish of the fisherman of Kuching. Oh, you can say let it. me guess, it's yeah. Kettle Robot, right? Yeah, something like that, yeah. And besides that, cake lapis as well? Cake lapis yeah. is also there. That's amazing. Okay, in your opinion, how does uh, this degrocery help the local, especially local entrepreneurs, manpower? Yeah, that's a nice question. Mm. Uh, <laughs> we have the manpower of um, Sarawak. We have Sarawakians who are working for us. We are also helping the entrepreneurs, like the local entrepreneurs, like Farley, like Emart, like Takyong, and other supermarkets here. When, our, when we get the orders, when we go, get the orders from our customers, we get it from these supermarkets and we deliver it to our customers. Thinking about that, as we all know, Strawa is gearing up towards a digital economy roadmap. As a businessman yourself, uh, the grocery founder, yeah. can you tell us what is your opinion on that? This is really a great initiative mm. taken because the whole world is, uh, this is the time of technology right now. This is the time of globalization in which the world is moving really fast with technology. Every single day, new things are coming. It will attract all the local and international entrepreneurs to come to Sarawak, to come to Borneo and bring their service here and do business here. Because it's really an opportunistic area. It's really an opportunistic, uh, you can say, a nation. And Sarawak is really growing fast. So. By taking this uh, digital initiative, it will bring, it will gather other international and local entrepreneurs to bring new services in Kuching through digital and through uh, technological way. That is very true and I agree with everything you said actually. Mr. Naim, what do you feel about the digital ecosystem in Sarawak? Does it give you the support that you need? Yeah, this uh, Sarawak uh, is giving a lot of support to the entrepreneurs who want to do something digitally. Sarawak uh, right now is growing, Kuching is growing, and then we want to grow together with Sarawak. You can see the SDEC is here, you can see Magic is here, you can see Borneo 744 is here, you can see IQ Innovation is there, you can see SMA is here, a lot of different sorts of support to, for the digital entrepreneurs, for the tech entrepreneurs. So because of that, it really uh, attracts me to invest here, to grow with this city, to do something for the city because the support is really amazing. So you think it's a good idea to invest in businesses in Sarawak? Of course, it's really a good idea because the city is growing, the city is developing, you will develop too, you serve them and you will reach the destination you want. Yeah. You really do great here in Sarawak. So, um, do you have, before we go, yeah. before we go, do you have any advice to the entrepreneurs out there who wants to use local, uh, e-commerce as a platform for the businesses? Yes. Right now, this is the time, this is the era of technology. Mm. So the youths, the entrepreneurs, they can do a lot with this technology. There are a lot of different services outside in the world, in the developed world, which is still not in Borneo, which is still not in Kuching. So they can bring those services here in Kuching and they can really do great and they will really do great with this type, this type of technological solution. They can bring a lot of digital and technological solution and innovative solutions which will really help the city grow, which will really help the entrepreneurs grow. Thank you so much, Mr. Naim. Terima kasih semua. Terima kasih inovasi pertiwiku. Terima kasih inovasi pertiwiku. Alright, jangan kemana-mana kembali lagi selepas ini.